It's an unusual road which connects an Indiana farm and classical music. But for part-time farmer Carol Klimperer Green, it's the road she chooses to travel. I just I need to hear your, the note. <laughs> Shall we start right there on that piano? becoming harder and harder for me to travel for music, which is what I was doing a great deal of. And so I decided to form the string quartet and bring the music to us instead of having to go always to it. Carol still lives on the family farm where she grew up, but for Sister Erica, the road led to London, England, where she plays violin with the City of London Symphonia. Each summer, for the past 12 years, she returns to her musical roots. It's nice to be in the country again. And it's a beautiful spot of land, even if I weren't attached to it. I think I, it strikes me again when I come back to it. It's a special little place. To me, music is a very physical thing, and farming is a very spiritual thing, and so they feed each other. The spirit of nature and the spirit of music, they're not separate. They've both always been a part of my life because my father started me on the violin when I was five years old. Her father, George Klimperer, died in a tractor accident in 1965. In memory of his dedication to music and nature, his daughters reunite each summer for a memorial concert. Music lovers eagerly anticipate the annual festival, but Erica says for their mother, the concert has a particularly special meaning. For her, it's a coming together of their dreams of having music and nature and the farm and their children and living to see her children create this festival on the farm so it's a sort of coming together. What would this have meant to their father? There's little question in Carol's mind. Of course he'd love it. No question about that because Music and farming and family were his life, and uh, it's continued to be my life. 